Hey, what's up YouTube? In today's video, we're going to talk about the different sectors in the stock market and the pros and cons of each one and why you might want to be invested in certain sectors over the others, especially regarding the technology sector. So there's a bunch of sectors, you know, there's the healthcare sector, there's consumer staples, which are everyday goods, there's consumer cyclicals, which are things like television and more luxury goods like cars. Depending on the business cycle of the economy, you're going to actually want to be weighted more heavily into different industries. For example, if you think that there's going to be tough times ahead, it's a good idea to be in more defensive sectors, which include things like healthcare, consumer staples, and utilities. Those are our defensive sectors because they tend to do okay even in a recession. If we're going through a period of economic expansion, then you want to be in the consumer cyclicals, uh, technology. Depending on how you want to construct your portfolio, you can allocate accordingly. Getting into, you know, what is my favorite sector long term? It's the technology sector. If there's something that I'm seeing in this world is that technology taking over the world in where wealth is becoming increasingly concentrated and technology goes hand in hand with that because with technology comes efficiency and whoever owns the technology ultimately you know reaps all the benefits and we can see this that now in our economy you know apple overtook exxon as as the largest cap company technology companies have the most capital they have the highest market caps people understand that technology is the future you know google amazon facebook you know those three are really they're the key players they have so much money they're worth more than entire countries being invested in technology is just a no-brainer you know i believe that a lot of industries are going to die you know jobs are going to go away as automation fills them but if you invest in the companies that own the technology that are replacing the jobs there's still a chance that you can accumulate wealth within your lifetime even if you did happen to lose your jobs you see as technology scales exponentially the need for humans goes away and basically the capital will flow to these companies because I believe that eventually like AI and automation may replace humans. The structure of corporations will exist long enough so that the flow of capital will go to the technology and the owners of that technology first and that wave will happen. Who knows, maybe the AI robot kills us all. But before that happens, I do think that there will be a mass accumulation of wealth into these companies that are using artificial intelligence to create more and more profits because just like in the stock market, algorithmic trading is, is taking over, um, they're better than humans, you know, AI is better than a doctor at diagnosing certain cancers or radiographies and so it's, it just seems logical to me that, you know, artificial intelligence is going to be more profitable than humans they're going to know how to make money and extract wealth from the system and the good thing is that these robots or these the, these programs are going to be within the confines of certain companies at first and so there's definitely an opportunity for you to capitalize on that so technology the technology sector if, if i was invested in the stock market what I would be invested in is I would literally only invest in technology companies that have artificial intelligence uh, programs because I think that that is the long term future and for most people you don't want to be day trading you don't even want to be swing trading you know you want to just buy and hold and so as automation develops at this exponential rate it's going to happen in our lifetime so don't be ignorant about it don't think that Oh, it's so far off. These, these artificial programs are already beating humans at chess, at Go, at poker. You know, they've already developed a certain amount of intelligence that is remarkable. So, so anyways, that's why I love the technology sector. I would recommend, I would just buy technology stocks that invest in artificial intelligence. If you're into that, look at the stock ticker QQQ and then compare it to SPY and on Google Finance you can do a comparison of technology stocks versus the broader market 
And you'll see that for a long time, technology stocks have outperformed the general market for a long time. You must have these companies, these technology companies in there because they will be the future. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe. We're making new content every single day. And my goal is to help you reach financial freedom at a young age and become the best person you can be.